right, hello our people. Today we're gonna make a really easy tulip with origami paper. So your origami paper is a square. It's probably thin paper, so it's easier to fold. You're gonna rotate it a little bit so that the corner's on the bottom, like a diamond. Now we're gonna fold it in half. So we're gonna take the bottom corner, go up to the top corner, and press down and fold. And you can keep it closed and then we're going to go from this corner on the right over to the left because we're going to fold it in half again okay and then we're going to open it up okay so now we're going to make the right side of the like the right petal here so you're just going to flip this up like that. So you don't have to go all the way up to the middle line. You can have it opened a little bit so your tulip is open. So I just like to put my finger here at the bottom of this middle line and just kind of like fold this up. So that right there is good. And then fold it down. And then I do the same thing on the other side. So I just put my finger down here on the bottom of this line, fold it up to about right there. It can be as open or as closed as you want, like that. Then what you can do to make the, the petals less pointy is you can just flip it over and fold in the corner on the right and the corner on the left end. So you can just fold that in a little bit so it's like a line on the side and then fold this in a little bit so it's a line on the side. So that's the back there. Then you can flip it back over. So then you can glue this down, glue, you can glue this whole thing down to a piece of paper. So you can get a blue piece of paper and a glue stick and you can glue on the back of this and then press it down. And then after you do that with an oil pastel, you can draw a stem. You can do a petal and you can even do some grass okay or you can make the petal and the grass and or the leaf and everything and the stem with construction paper you can just draw it and cut it out with construction paper too you can finish coloring that and you can glue it down you can also use oil pastels to make clouds or whatever you want you could also draw a vase for the tulip to be in you could draw some more tulips around it, however you want to decorate it. All right, that's it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.